Are you tired of not having enough furniture and clothing straight of the early 1900s? Are you tired of not being able to make your grandmother's house? Well, this stuff pack might be for you. It's called Vintage Glamour, which is literally all old school early 1900s furniture and clothing. Well, I'm not going to show off the clothing because I don't care for it. The build mode stuff is actually pretty nice. I actually don't mind the build mode. It's kind of a mix though because some of the furniture looks a little eh, but some of it actually looks nice. You do get these, uh, what you call them, those makeup stations, which your sims can apply temporary makeup on, which is neat. Uh, and you get a, a globe, which inside contains juice, because that's what it's called in The Sims. You know, it's a little liquor globe. You open up the globe and it has all the juice you can pour in it. You can make little platters. That's neat. And uh, the other bit of gameplay is the introduction of the, uh, the butler, which is a live-in maid. And the butler is random too, so you never know who you're going to get. You can actually get a kleptomaniac butler, which will lead to some fun. So be careful when you get butlers. You never know what you're going to get. Over in the butler itself, well, they basically need you to give them a room and a bed, and then you have to pay them a lot of money every hour to keep them. And then you can either praise them, you can tell them to greet Sims when they come knocking at the door. Uh, you can tell them what they can and cannot do, what household chores you want them to do, and that's about it. Overall, it's a mixed bag of a, of a stuff pack. I don't really recommend it. I say this is a thumbs down on the recommendation. Wait for a sale. $10 for this ain't really worth it. To me, this is something I will never really use. Maybe some of the clothing sometimes? But that's about it. This pack overall is meh. And I give it two stars.